Elatec Vial is a medication that is used to prevent high levels of uric acid in the blood in children with cancer, such as leukemia, lymphoma, and solid malignant tumors, who are about to undergo chemotherapy treatment. Chemotherapy destroys cancer cells, releasing large amounts of uric acid into the bloodstream. This medication helps the kidneys remove the uric acid from the body more easily. The daily dosage and optimal timing for taking this medication should be determined by a healthcare professional. When using Elatec Vial, the medication is administered through an injection into a vein, as per your doctor's instructions, typically over a 30-minute period. Rasburicase is typically administered once a day for a span of 5 days. The timing of cancer chemotherapy and the doses of rasburicase is crucial, with chemotherapy typically beginning 4 to 24 hours following the initial dose of rasburicase. In addition to the medication, fluids are also administered through the vein to assist in reducing uric acid levels. Some common side effects of Elatec Vail may include nausea, vomiting, headache, stomach pain, constipation, diarrhea, or mouth sores slash ulcers. If any of these effects persist or worsen, it's important to inform your doctor or pharmacist promptly. It's important to remember that this medication has been prescribed to you because your doctor has determined that the benefits outweigh the potential risks of side effects. Many people using this medication do not experience serious side effects. However, you should contact your doctor immediately if you experience any serious side effects such as signs of infection, like a persistent sore throat, fever, or chills. In rare cases, very serious side effects may occur, including weakness, yellowing of the eyes or skin, dark urine, or a blue-slash-gray skin color. This is not a complete list of possible side effects, so it's important to contact your doctor or pharmacist if you notice any other effects not mentioned here. If you are in the U.S., you can call your doctor for medical advice about side effects, or report side effects to the FDA at 1-800-FDA-1088 or at www.fda.gov slash medwatch. In Canada, you can call your doctor for medical advice about side effects, or report side effects to Health Canada at 1-866-234-2345. This medication may cause a severe allergic reaction. If you experience symptoms such as chest pain, difficulty breathing, severe dizziness, itching slash swelling, or rash slash hives, stop taking this medication and seek medical help immediately. Do not resume taking this medication if you have had a severe allergic reaction. Consult your doctor or pharmacist for more information. Do not take this medication if you have a metabolic condition known as glucose 6-phosphate dehydrogenase G6PD, deficiency, as it can cause severe damage to your red blood cells and lead to anemia. If you are of African or Mediterranean descent, you may be at a higher risk for G6PD deficiency and should be tested for it before starting this medication. This medication can also cause a condition that affects the ability of your red blood cells to carry oxygen, known as methemoglobinemia. Do not continue taking this medication if you experience this effect, consult your doctor for more information. Additionally, this medication can interfere with uric acid blood levels, causing falsely low levels. Make sure to inform all lab personnel that you are taking this drug. Before using Elatec Vial, it's important to discuss any allergies you may have with your doctor or pharmacist, as well as any medical history of certain metabolic conditions, kidney disease, or dehydration. It's also important to inform your doctor or dentist of all the products you use before having surgery, including prescription drugs, non-prescription drugs, and herbal products. If you have children under 2 years old, they may be more sensitive to the side effects of this drug. During pregnancy, Elatecville should only be used when clearly needed, and the risks and benefits should be discussed with your doctor. It is unknown if this drug passes into breast milk, so breastfeeding is not recommended while using this drug and for two weeks after the last dose. When taking Elatec Vial, it's important to be aware of potential drug interactions that may affect how your medications work or increase the risk of serious side effects. Make sure to keep a list of all the products you use, including prescription slash non-prescription drugs and herbal products, and share it with your doctor and pharmacist. It's crucial to not start, stop, or change the dosage of any medicines without your doctor's approval. Additionally, it's important to note that this medication can interfere with the uric acid in blood sample tubes if the tubes are left at room temperature, which can lead to falsely low uric acid results. 
Therefore, lab personnel must follow special procedures to process the blood sample when Elatech vial is being used. Be sure to consult with your healthcare provider for the best time to take this medication and the appropriate daily dosage for your specific needs. If someone has taken too much Elatech vial and is experiencing severe symptoms like losing consciousness or difficulty breathing, it is important to seek immediate medical help. In the U.S., you can call your local poison control center at 1-800-222-1222, and in Canada, you can call a provincial poison control center. When using Elatech vial, it's important to have regular lab and medical tests to monitor your uric acid levels. Make sure to keep all your medical and lab appointments, and consult your doctor for more details. Make sure to take each dose of Elatech vial according to the schedule provided by your doctor. If you happen to miss a dose, consult your doctor or pharmacist immediately for a new schedule. This medication, Elatech vial, is administered in a hospital or clinic setting and should not be stored at home. It is used to treat high levels of uric acid in the blood caused by certain types of cancer and is typically given over a period of 15 minutes. The dosage and frequency of administration will be determined by your healthcare provider based on your specific medical condition. It is important to follow their instructions carefully. Elatech vial is given through a needle placed in a vein, and the infusion process is monitored closely by medical professionals to ensure safety and effectiveness. It is important to discuss any concerns or questions with your healthcare provider before starting treatment with Elatech vial. If you need more help, call your doctor for medical advice. In the US, you call FDA 1 800 FDA 1088. In Canada, you may call Health Canada, 1-866-234-2345. Wishing you good health. Thanks for watching.